So in this class we are going to discuss about uh, evolution in gases exchange system. Okay. So this gases exchange is very very important. So gas oxygen is important for every organism. We know that. So how this gases exchange takes place? For a gases exchange, you need to do one thing. It is not same in all the organisms. Okay. And it will okay with all the gases exchange. Jaga do. In unicellular organisms like amoeba, paramecium. And in some multicellular organisms also, okay, like hydra, planaria, rockworms, earthworms. So, in these organisms, gases exchange takes place through their body surface by a process called the diffusion. Okay, only unicellular organisms lo, ek ana ek ana jiu na pronunciation kore different hundi. Okay, ek ana jiu na bahu ana jiu multicellular. So, in some multicellular organisms, only multicellular organisms like hydra, paramecium lo. टोटल बॉडी सरफेस द्वारा जरूरत होती है एक्सचेंज ऑफ गैसेस दैट इज कॉल्ड द सिंपल डिफ्यूजन इन अदर मल्टीसेलुलर ऑर्गेनिजम्स ई मल्टीसेलुलर ऑर्गेनिजम्स का कुंडा वेरे मल्टीसेलुलर ऑर्गेनिजम्स लाइक हायर ऑर्गेनिजम्स लाइक ह्यूमन बीइंग्स दे हैव डेवलप्ड डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ ऑर्गन्स फॉर गैसेस एक्सचेंज रकरकाला मल्टीसेलुलर ऑर्गेनिजम्स लो रकरकाला ऑर्गन्स ऐते डेवलप होई हुंदा है ओके व्हाई डिफरेंट ऑर्गेनिजम्स हैव डिफरेंट रेस्पिरेटरी सिस्टम ये रेस्पिरेटरी सिस्टम में नहीं, वेरे वेरे आर्गनिज्म्स लो वेरे वेरे ना ये तो कुंडे। What is the reason? So that is because of its habitat, where they are living, and its body size, and also availability of water, and also the type of circulatory system. What ये उनका habitat वेरे वेरे का उन्हें डर। कोनी, some are living in the water bodies, some are living on the land, and body size, कोनी छिन्न का उन्हें डर, कोनी चालू पैदल का उन्हें डर। So that is one reason. And availability of water. कोने के वाटर अवेलेबल होंडे एडवांटेज फैक्टर्स ने डेवलप चीज को नहीं एंड आल्सो टाइप ऑफ सर्कुलेटरी सिस्टम सो दिस आर द रीजंस फॉर द व्हाट एवोल्यूशन ऑफ गैसेस एक्सचेंज सिस्टम हाउ दे आर गोइंग टू एक्सचेंज देयर गैसेस सो सो बेस्ड ऑन दैट क्राइटेरिया बेस्ड ऑन देयर हैबिटेट बॉडी साइज टाइप ऑफ सर्कुलेटरी सिस्टम अवेलेबिलिटी ऑफ वाटर सो बेस्ड ऑन दिस दे आर क्लासिफाइड इनटू दिस कैटेगरीज ओके लेट मी डिस्कस फर्स्ट ट्राकियल रेस्पिरेटरी सिस्टम In this respiratory system, we can see the diagram of respiratory system tracheal. So, example cockroach and grasshopper. So, tracheal respiratory system occurs in grasshopper, cockroach, and almost all the insects. What they have? They have holes on their body surface. So, that holes are called spiracles. In what term? What is it? Spiracles. From spiracle, so a tube is arranged. That tube is called a trachea. A tube name and term trachea. All tubes are making a network-like system. So these are called a tracheal system. Every tube is directly connected with the cells. So gas अने ये oxygen अने ये इस pyrakis द्वारा trachea द्वारा directly cells की वैली पोट होती है. So in this way exchange of gases. Similarly, okay, the carbon dioxide returns in the same way. So this is called a tracheal respiratory system. अतः सिर्फ cockroach and grasshopper. Come to branchial respiratory system if respiration takes place through gills that is called branchial respiratory system so example fish and tadpole this is larva of the frog let us see the picture of this branchial respiratory system in this system so this gills gills are present near the pharynx pharynx chuttupakkala ee gills anedi untayi fish lo mana chen telusu okay so for example so this is a fish you can see the gills How the gills are arranged? All gills are arranged in the form of gill pouches. Gill pouches are not arranged in the way. Each gill pouch having gill lamella. I am talking about gill lamella. So that is the region. Okay. So this region look like regions are called gill lamella. Okay. So this gill lamella are highly supplied with blood capillaries. Okay. When fish is open its mouth. Okay. Keep the floor of the oral cavity down. Then water is get enter into the fish mouth. Then after entering the water, then mouth is going to close. When it is close the mouth, then the floor of the cavity rises. Okay. Then the water is forcefully enter into the pharynx. Then from pharynx it goes to all the gill pouches. Then gill pouches into gill lamella. Okay. If today the fish kinda right there, then the buccal cavity, oral cavity ni open just so the water entry out. एंट्री आयना वेंटर है माउथ नी क्लोजेस होती है ये पढ़े तो माउथ नी क्लोजेस होता है ओरल कैविटी आयने दी पाइक लेस होती है दें इट फोर्स फुली एंटर्स है ना कुछ चम प्रेशर तो वाटर नी फेरारिंग्स लोग पापलिस होती है तो वाटर व्हेन इट इस मूविंग थ्रू द गिल पोजेस ओके आर गिल लैमेलस ये गिल लैमेलस नी वाटर इल 
लैवेलर द्वारा वे सो ई वाटर आक्सीजन सो गेट डिफ्यूज इन टू द्लड क्या ओके अंड दैपुले आलरे कंटे कॉबन डयाक्सइड दट कम फ्रम द कैपुले सो इन दिस वे बै द प्रासेस का सिंपल डिफ्यूजन एक्सचेज टेक्स प्लेस बिटवी द वाटर अंड सो दट इज का ब्रांकिल रेस्पिटरी सिस्टम ओके कम टू नैक्स्ट वन क्यूटेनियस रेस्पिटरी सिस्टम सो इट इज अकर्स इन फ्रा जनरली अकर्स इन फ्रा If respiration takes place through skin, that is called cutaneous respiration. We can see in the diagram here. So over the skin, so this skin is very moist. Okay, cutaneous respiration. जब पड़ा कि skin ना नहीं थी, चाला तड़िगा होता है. Okay, so skin कंटे below the skin, subcutaneous layer कंटे many blood capillaries. Skin की ना blood capillaries चाला rich का होता है. So directly air is get enter into the skin through this moist skin. And carbon dioxide exit from the skin. So skin helps in exchange of gases. So that process called cutaneous respiration. From no incubation pura utho di. That is called bacco pharyngeal cavity. Okay. This from also respire through bacco pharyngeal cavity. So during this type of respiration, ye pura jab tu niya the. Whenever it is come to land, land pane na uchna puru, ini, ini daga respiration jab tu di. So in this bacco pharyngeal cavity, completely mouth buccal cavity is closed, only internal nares, only nares are open. So that is going to lining of the buccal cavity. In lining of the buccal cavity, lo ne gases exchange jab tu bolu di. Okay, so that is called bacco pharyngeal cavity because inside the membrane it is rich with blood capillaries. Come to last type of respiration, highly developed type of respiration, pulmonary respiratory system. If respiration takes place through lungs, lungs, okay, called pulmonary respiration. We can see this type of pulmonary respiration in reptiles, birds, and mammals. Highly developed organisms respire through lungs. Pulmonary respiration are the birds, no, reptiles, no, or mammals, no, they do it. Okay. So already we have discussed in this lesson.